Uh, I just realized I'm gonna have to charge my battery here soon or I'm not gonna have a camera to use today. All right, so what's up everybody? I just was at Starbucks trying to apply for jobs and stuff on TWC or whatever it's called. And my plan was to apply for multiple jobs today, but I was applying for a warehouse job at Pepsi and it ended up taking like an hour to do all of that, ask all these questions and stuff. And yeah, so I'm probably not gonna get it, but it pays good to be a warehouse job. So full time, lots of work, but I mean, good pay will overdo anything. And I'm not a stranger to that. My battery's already about to die. So let me just tell you what I was gonna say. So basically I'm about to go head to the RV Start cleaning it up, see if we can get that done today, toss all the junk out of it, do whatever, clean it up, vacuum, shampoo, wipe down, all this stuff, you know. I have like no money now, I'm actually, the coffee I'm drinking is all thanks to everybody who sent me a little bit of PayPal money, because you guys are amazing, you're literally the only reason I was able to get coffee today, and yeah, I gotta go do that, charge the camera, hi puppy, before the camera dies. Got myself a peanut butter and honey sandwich. Just chilling out here. My uncle is gonna get some stuff worked out so we can move the trailer. Cause it's a fifth wheel, I can't really do anything myself. But he's got a lot of trucks out here at the shop, so. I got most of the stuff cleaned up actually. I was gonna film it, but like as soon as I walked in, most of the stuff inside is pretty much good i toss a lot of stuff in a corner it took me like five minutes most of the problem is just dust and dirt inside of it like stuff needs cleaned out um but yeah as soon as we get electricity and water that's halfway through the process of getting it cleaned i had like five dislikes on the last video and i think it has mostly to do with the fact that i said i'm getting a house instead of in the jeep but the funny thing about that is I really don't think that the people watched the video before they like disliked it. They just disliked it because they're like, how dare he live in a house after living in his Jeep. Now, I don't want to live in a house. It's mostly for Kai. So I can just put him somewhere for now. The, it's like free daycare. So, I mean, it's not a huge deal. I don't even know if I'd sleep in it. I might just utilize it for like my stuff and getting stuff organized. But it would help to have like a home base. I mean, the only other option is right now I'm basically driveway surfing like I'm not couch surfing like I'm parking in people's driveways just because so Okay, so I was editing the video and I found out that I had filmed the whole video but I somehow lost like half if not all of the video footage. I got to the point that you're gonna see and then I had a bunch of stuff after that and the videos disappeared. So I don't know what happened to them, I think they're gone. So this is gonna be a two part video which is good because it'll make more sense this way. much luck with the little air compressor and the pancake over here. <laughs> Weird. What'd you do with 
water, Kai. Well guys, we have reached the level of success that is kind of living in someone else's house, I guess, still. But, I mean, the guy apparently doesn't do anything with this thing. Basically told me, clean it up, you can use it. And there's so much junk in here that, it, like, smells like dirt and I gotta clean stuff, so. It's got some water leaks and stuff, but for the most part, it seems like everything works. AC works, heater works. Um, it took us forever to get this stupid thing out, but, like, after playing with it for a long time, it came out. Some stuff I'm gonna have to plug, water, things like that. There's some rat poop places, but microwave works, so I have a microwave now. It's gonna be really cool being here for a while. Um, I can understand people who aren't very happy with this choice, like moving into an RV instead of living in my Jeep, but also understand that I'm. it's not really my choice either. If all those people who dislike my video were supporting me, that would just make me one step closer to living back in my Jeep. It's what I want to do, and that's actually the whole reason I'm here, is to fix the Jeep, get a job, and get back on the road as soon as possible. I, what I want to do, it's the whole reason I started this trip in the first place. Nobody else wants me to get back out there as much as I want to get back out there. But until I get stuff worked out, I can't. And the best way for me to get back out there is to get a job and make money as soon as possible and having this place just makes all that easier on top of that just having a place I can sit down and make my own coffee and in the morning and that it gives me more time to edit more videos and stuff it gives me more time to ha have a place to sit down and do stuff usually the biggest struggle with making videos on the road is finding a place where I can actually just sit down and get work done now I don't have to go anywhere I can just do it here and I haven't asked yet, but they might even have Wi-Fi here. It's my uncle's shop. It's right around the corner. So, like, there's stuff here. It would appear that from now on, this is going to be my home. It's not much, but I mean, it's definitely a lot more than the Jeep, so can't complain there. It's not as exciting, but I mean, it's cozy. It works. Excuse me, puppy. I'm going to try to put these blankets on. Excuse me. Excuse me. Miss! Miss Puffy. Kai. You can get back on the bed when I'm done. No, get off. I need you to get off for now. Get off. Kai. Off. No. Off. Dude. Kai. When I stab, it doesn't mean do a trick. Come on. Off. Good boy. It'll work. We will make it work. What's it like, Kai? What's it like? Doing home repair. Out of here. Probably want to remove these bottles.